Hey, Vizant here. In this video, we'll look up Ocarona and Kingdra. Usually, you don't want to run hidden ability, but we're gonna look for it anyways, and you guys can decide for yourself. All right, Ocarona. It has hidden ability Swarm, and Swarm is if it's under one third of its maximum HP, all its bug move will increase by fifty percent. But usually people don't run that, they run Flame Body. And Flame Body is 30% of inflicting burn when it comes in contact with another Pokemon. Right? So, we're gonna show you the den. It's gonna be den number 114. And den 114 you want is a purple beam. Uh, we're gonna fly to the dojo. And if you guys don't know, I also stream on Twitch. So feel free to drop by. I stream Nintendo games, gotcha games. Uh, if you need help with questions or whatever, just come by and ask live. So you want to go to go left after you fly to the dojo. This is the, the den that you want. We're going to save because we want a purple beam. It's pretty much the same as the talent flame one. The video I just did before, so feel free to check that out. But we're going to press home right here. If it's red beam, you're going to close it and you're going to go back in and do it again. Until you get a purple beam. So it took a long time for me to get a purple beam to spawn. But we do have it here. This is Den 114 and it has 4 star 15% and 5 star 20% for Volcarona. So let's see if we got a Volcarona here. It's not. So make sure you're offline. Uh, most likely you are because you've been trying to get a purple beam. You would do the time skip trick now to try to roll for Volcarona. So you hit invite others, press home. Press system settings here. System, daytime. If you have it on, turn it off. Uh, increase this by one day, click OK, press home, go back into the game, quit. Right, once you quit the room, it'll reset the den. Uh, you can farm wasps like this too. So hopefully you guys get this. Uh, Volcarona, you keep doing this until you get Volcarona, pretty much. Alright, finally got Volcarona. And... And it took a while, <laughs> surprisingly. Okay, so there is another den. I'm gonna do stab. There is another den. I mean, there is, there's the same den, but you can get a red beam for the same den too. It will be, it will be there. It's just that the rate for Volcarona is 15% only, while the purple beam has 15% for the four star and 20% for a five star, right? So the higher chance of doing it in a purple beam. But yeah, you can totally do it in the red beam as well. It's just that you also can encounter the vent beam and you gotta like reroll the the wishing piece again oh. anyways i totally lost the train of thought doing that but yeah hidden ability full purple beam mechanics now in the dlc please hit once you hit yeah we got i i encountered a four star so Whatever. Each life. Not one third HP yet, right? Oh, we have Clara in here. Ready to demolish one shot. Oh. I bring a tracer just in case. But so far, all the purple beams have hidden abilities. I already do have one, um, but I'm gonna throw a Premier Ball anyways. Maybe I just throw a Pokeball. It'll be red and it'll match. Eh, whatever. Let's go. Host guaranteed. Boom. Boom. And... Boom. Alright, Kingdra. So, usually people don't run a hidden ability because its hidden ability is damp. And damp means self-destruct explosion, mind blow, misty explosions on the work on the field. Which ability itself sucks compared to swift, swift, swift Swim. When it rains, its speed is double, which is usually what people run. And it's also Sniper if you want to run a crit build. Um, you do critical damage of 225% instead of the original 150. So it does spawn in 
den 132 and den 131 which is the same den except one's purple and one's red um so we're gonna go to the fields of honor fly point here um the only thing is that the purple beam has a higher spawn rate they have a 20 percent of for a five star for spawning kingdra while the red beam is a 15 percent for a five star so you're gonna go to this den right here you this is the one right here. Um, I'm going to hide here so I can like save. And I can see the purple beam instead of the red beam. I'm going to save because we're going to do the trick. We're going to press home once we hit yes after the save. And if it's a red beam like so, you would close the game. You would just go in and you would do it again. All right, we finally got a purple beam. So let's see if it's a king or not. But either way, I will show you how to do the time skip trick. So you can you can roll for a king So it's not a king um, so you want to be offline, which I already am because I've been rerolling for purple beams. You want to click invite others for the time skip trick. Make sure you go in there. Press home. Go to system settings. Go to system, date time. If you have this on for synchronize, turn it off. Increase your date by one day, whatever it is. Um, and then go back in the game and press quit. Click quit the room and it will respawn the den into a new Pokemon and you keep doing this until you find a Kingdra, which is the dragon den right here. Alright, so apparently you can surprise, you can also do it with a Seedra, because it's a purple beam, right? So 25% for a 3 star and 25% for a 4 star. You can also get hidden ability Seedra here as well. And so yeah, you can get either Kingdra or Seedra, so just go for either one. And then just breed it or evolve it, whichever you want to do. And this one is not a dragon type, right? So it's at least weak against electricity, not just dragon. They can hit it with, you know, it's a regular water Pokemon. <laughs> oh, ham. I was like, I couldn't spawn a Kingdra. So instead, I spawn a Seedra with the same thing. It's pretty much the same thing. This is one of the three star, so it's gonna be a lot easier. And good thing. Wait, even a shield. Oh my God, Weva, why do you not activate shields for me? What a instant KO! Cause I hit the freaking shield threshold. Okay. Be the. But not fast enough, right? It's only a 3 star. Next dragon. Of course. Giga Drain. Oh yeah. And we have random Torkoal. I don't... Play the door. <laughs> Those are a decent chunk of damage for a not very effective move. Alright, dead. And you just, I'm just gonna throw uh gonna throw a premier ball, I guess. I think I already have one though. I have a Kingdra already. If I ever decide to breed down or something. I have a oh dive ball. Dead ball. Yeah. Blue, blue. Oh. This I'm post is guaranteed catch. I don't know. Do I keep showing you guys that I caught it? Wait it out. <laughs> yeah, see, and there, there you go. Alright, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Um, please give it a like, comment what you want me to do next, or if you have any feedback, I'll take that. And also subscribe for upcoming more videos on these. And also check out my live stream. I do stream these as well. So you're welcome to come by live and suggest something or you can actually join live. But anyways, thanks for watching. Later days.